Hello everyone, delighted to be talking to you from one of my favourite venues in world football, the Orange Vélodrome. I'm Derek Ray and adjacent to me in the commentary box is Stuart Robson. And if this game lives up to its billing, we're in for a riveting occasion. It's France facing Real Madrid. Well, thanks Derek as always. The scene is set, two good teams, a great playing surface and a vibrant atmosphere. It has all the ingredients for a really exciting game. Far from a good pass. Here's the side France will go with. Mike Mignon begins in goal. Benjamin Pavard plays with Dayo Upamecano in central defence. And in attack today, Kylian Mbappe starts together with Kingsley Coman. Real Madrid get the throw in. And let's dissect the Real Madrid side. Thibaut Courtois is in goal. Luka Modric plays with Tony Kors in the centre of the park. And the main goal scoring threat provided today by Karim Benzema. And support available. Luka Modric. Well, a bit of an unforced error, and it's going to be a throw. He's lost it. Modric. Well, the attacking options appear plentiful. And gobbled up with ease by the keeper. Good technique displayed. And that was simply miles off target. Well, I think he's right to go for power, but he's made the wrong connection, and it's really poor technique in the end. Teo Hernandez. Mbappe. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Free kick awarded then by the referee. To take the lead. Excellent save from Thibaut Courtois. Played in by Griezmann, and still an opportunity. Oh, and he puts away the second chance, but the goalkeeper angry with himself here. Well, here it is again. And I don't think it's good enough from the goalkeeper, you have to say that. He spilled it right into the danger zone, and at this level, you're always going to be punished. So Real restart the game. Disappointed to have conceded. Can they find an equaliser? Coman. Coman. Oh, a lovely incisive pass. Well cleared away, but at the expense of a corner. Trying to deliver it accurately. Not away completely. Oh, really commanding goalkeeping. Growing pressure here, and another corner. A really meat and drink to the keeper under the circumstances. Modric. Benzema. Kamavinga. Tony Kroos, France with the ball again. Safe pair of hands, did his job. Well, it's a really poor challenge. Now, what's the referee going to do about it? And following the infringement, a caution. Yeah, no surprise there. That was always going to be a booking. Eduardo Camavinga. Real Madrid have given it away. Eduardo Camavinga. Not a foul, but the advantage with Real Madrid. Useful looking position, you've got to say. Benzema. Oh, he looks threatening. And a very good challenge. 
Well, there it is. France just haven't had as much of the ball, but their attacking play has been really incisive. It's been a really good display from them so far. And the threat on the counter-attack is very real. Here they come again. Mbappe's finish, his goal. So lethal in front of goal. has given the advantage to Real Madrid and they continue to advance and a lot of options here offside the decision just not looking confident in possession and they've given him too much space Camavinga it's there for him, and the keeper did more than enough. Now, how about the short corner? Course. Happy to take on the shot, and fine goalkeeping. And deciding to go short with this one. Well, another corner, hot on the heels of the last one. They take it short. Giving them a different option by moving in field. sloppy in possession Rodrigo well very shortly we'll be hearing the half time interval room for improvement as far as Real Madrid are concerned in this one Stuart I have to say Derek they haven't played well they've been slow in possession they've been poor defensively and they've lacked a cutting edge they need to perform much better than this just one minute of stoppage time, say the officials. Oh, it was a terrible looking challenge and a big decision for the official here. Well, the referee produces the red card, an obvious one, Stuart. Well, they'll need to reorganise quickly here. He really has let them down with that challenge. He's played it short here. Well, time is up as far as the first half is concerned here in Marseille. Into the second half then. Will it be more of the same from France? They were breathtaking in the first 45, you've got to say. Are they capable of matching that in the second half? Not what he was intending, bad pass. Federico Valverde. Vinicius Junior. Corner for Real Madrid. Well, he couldn't pick out a teammate inside the box. Kylian Mbappe. Well, nicely cut out. Carvajal. And a fine tackle. And it's the vision of Griezmann coming to the fore. Stop. 
Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. And his movement's so clever. Once he gets onto it, there's only one thought in his head. Smash it as hard as possible. What a good goal. So the action continues, and France really beginning to run away with this now. The scoreline threatening to get ugly. Showing a real will to win the ball. Oh, good vision. Oh, the referee points to the spot. Penalty. And to add insult to injury, it's a booking, Stuart. Well, I agree with the penalty. I'm not quite so sure about the yellow card, though. And that is when you need your goalkeeper. Over the top line for what will be a Real Madrid throw. And a good take under duress there. Thirty minutes left for play, and he's in. And still danger here. Well, goal kick, just as it was looking promising. Eder Militao and Valverde. Rodrigo, Vinicius Junior. Here's Kroos. What a genuine opportunity, but it was squandered. Goal kick. Doesn't want to lose his cool here. Coman. And perhaps Griezmann! Well, there to intercept. Well, flinging himself up the ball. Played in by Griezmann. Struggling to get it away. Threat over for now, it seems. Benzema and the danger is averted and giving the ball to the opposition that time he's in behind is it going to be there it is and he could scarcely have had an easier finish Well, here it is again, and the pace in which they break forward is devastating. It's so hard to defend against, and then he makes the finish look so easy, taking it around the goalkeeper before slotting it home. It's a lovely goal. And this is turning into something of a rout. 4-0. And into the last 15 minutes of action. Far from a good pass. Counter-attacking, very much an option. All hands on deck. Mbappe. Can they keep it out? And thumped away. Kunde. Now what can they do from here? Griezmann. Oh, there it is! It's one goal up! Speaks to the quality of that performance. Well, here's the replay, and he shows great awareness to play this through ball. And Griezmann does the rest. He strikes it so clearly, there's no stopping that one. Well, if there were any lingering doubts about the outcome, surely they now have been removed. Rudiger. Now, Edo Militao. Tony Kroos. 
It's with Kingsley Coman. Textbook closing down, and now they're on the attack. That's well blocked, and fine goalkeeping. So the corner played into the box. Well, just the kind of save every goalkeeper would expect to make. Modric. Real chance. And it's there for him. Really digging in at the back. But still the opportunity. Griezmann. Mbappe. Perfect example of how to put in a tackle. And a corner will be next. Well, the fans are going mad here. They think that was a penalty. Baba. Griezmann. Can he finish? And blocked for now. And the referee says, enough is enough. That's the end of the game. I think the players might be thinking, enough is enough. Because this moves them ever closer to the spectre of relegation. Well, this has been the story of their season so far. They were second best in too many departments. And they didn't have the determination to dig out a result here. It doesn't look good, does it? Well, choose your descriptive word where Kylian Mbappe is concerned. Explosive is one adjective you could use, Stuart. Well, he gave that back line a torrid time, didn't he? He was far too sharp for them, always looking to play on the shoulder, took his goals well.